Amazon stock 20. I just seem to get lost as an economist and a statistician. Mathematics. No feelings, no regrets. So, should I run Amazon and have 500 billion sales? All companies are slowing new employees. Some are laying employees off. Now, Amazon has 1.6, I guess, employees. We are a worldwide economy. Some countries have big minimum wage, other countries have no minimum wage. <laughs> yes, can you imagine? Yes, but this is it. So, then they all meet in big summits, these governments and prime ministers. And they, some have minimum wage, others don't have minimum wage. Some have these structural systems, others have another. And I recommend not to buy the CEO of Amazon, a blue house, a brown house, a yellow, yellow submarine, and a, 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 a yellow plane, and have summits every day, and 60,000 security guards just to go with the CEO towards this uh, summit here and there. And uh, because, of course, it is very important to have a community giving back something. And what we can give them back is no more expense, can we? Then the same question arises in Amazon. I just wonder, we have 50 billion sales, yeah. Can we communicate to shareholders, which I happen to be one? Now, what are we doing to increase profits? Good. I am not going to lay off. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Just communicate. But I'm not going to contract. Oh, well, thank you very much indeed. Then I am not going to buy any more warehouses. Oh, well, I'm going to lease. Oh, thank you. Then I am not going to do any layoffs, but I'm going to say that 400,000 above $100,000 is too much today. So I'm going to limit those wages, either you like it or not. It's like if I say, Prime Ministers and Ministers and the governments and the buildings must have a wage of one dollar for all. I mean, the, the whole countries, yes, they must spend the dollar, yes. Then I would just say, oh, come on, how can I get that passport? How can I put that the headquarter? Can we say these companies? Of course we can. So we can give to the community back a lot of things in Amazon. But the first thing is communicate to the community that have invested in Amazon. What are we going to do? Well, because it happens that amongst all the NASDAQ, it is the biggest employer. And it is the biggest silence. And I wonder that as a shareholder, of course, I want to retain talent, but if I have 500 billion of sales revenue, why should I have a loss? Okay, I made a mess with Rivian. Yes, good, let's get chips. But the question is, if I have 500 billion of sales, I don't have to go to Harvard to understand that uh, revenue minus cost equal profit. So what is the solution? Perhaps some employees would say, oh, come on, we agree. This is going to be hard times. We have had the loss. We, we are okay with $100,000 per year, are we? Is it responsible or do we have to employ in Indonesia or in India or in Africa, the headquarter, and then how much profit would we get? Could Amazon communicate and give back to the community of shareholders? Is this ESG, Environment, Social Governance, Corporate Social Responsibility, communicate what are we doing? Yes, I believe that the most interested party is the workers, because if we have a sound company, then your jobs would be here for the long term. And that is our task as business persons and shareholders. It is, yes, don't forget that we employ, yes. 
then we could make a lot of measures like impact of the MIDI, 133 disruptions I made, 65 associations videos or 70, then Ocean's Wave, 12 videos, then uh, Generation Z, so many, and so on. By sector, like and subscribe. Thank you, Amazon, for everything.